Hello, this is Andrew, and I'm here in my shop, and just showing you around here a lot of the computer, computer parts, components, monitors, tons of computer boards and boxes and everywhere. Well, I wanted to make this video to demonstrate and to show you what pins are, because there seems to be an individual that's having a problem understanding what pins are. First I have right here is this beautiful motherboard and you can see that this motherboard is loaded with very beautiful gold-plated pins. Close up here. And there's more pins here and you can see that these pins are wire wrapped. And I have another motherboard here. As you can see, it has pins too. Those of us that are into recovering gold from computers, this is what we're after. Mainly is these pins and coarse fingers. <clears throat> I have over here some pins in a bag that were took an off of boards and I have a variety of CPUs. This mainly is, con is concerned about PCUs. Here are a, a variety of PCUs. Here is a one of the black Intel uh, PCU as you can see from the top view and from the bottom view and a side view and as you can see clearly these are pins oops here's another CPU AMD, top view, side view, clearly you can see the pins, and from the bottom view, if that's what you want to call it, and these are pins. The gold-plated pins. Here's a, a even smaller computer chip. It's much smaller than the other ones, not much smaller, but a little smaller. And you can see as well that this too has pins in it. Rows and rows of pins. We have a, another CPU here, different type, AMD I believe, AMD, and you can see the gold plated pins on this CPU. Here's a, I believe this is a Pendulum 4, Intel Pendulum 4, I believe that's what this is. And you can see that here it has gold plated pins. And from a side view, you see there are, are pins there. And I have uh, some more CPUs in this container here full of different types of computer chips, CPUs, as abbreviation of what they are. And you can see all these are gold-plated pins. Those are the pins there at the end, and that's what we're mainly after in these CPUs, is the gold-plated pins. Now, there are, this is a, an i486, and we know that inside there, there are very fine micro wires in this area where my thumb is moving around and if you could force this off you will see those real very fine wires uh, but there's such fine same with this cap if we pull, force that cap off we will find some very fine wires in these CPUs I have a just a big box full of them and you can see they're all loaded down with pins on them now the main purpose of this 
video is to, is to let people see what pins are and the main purpose is, is that there's an individual on eBay whose name I'm not going to have to mention but this individual is selling what he calls a CPU which it is and then this is it the item that he's selling as a CPU his ad claims that these have pins on them his ads I said they are gold plated pins and as you can look at this it is flimsy and thin as a sheet of paper and here's the back of it and you see the square openings there are real fine wires there very fine wires why, why, probably why you can't see them if I kind of pull back but the open you can see right through it and you see this is semi transparent with a glossy finish on it now do you see any pins there are no pins whatsoever on this uh, CPU that he's selling on eBay and um, I confronted him about it and then he wanted to insult my intelligence by telling me that there were uh, very fine micro pins inside of the chip. Well, those of us that, that salvage these things, we're looking for pins. He says there are pins, and do you see any pins? See, I'm out here in the wind. The wind is blowing at. That's how thin this thing is. As you can see, it's standing in a sheet of paper. And there's gold on it, but there's not pins. These are not pins. This uh, is is a chip that he claims is made by uh, Kendale Square Research. And Sharp Corporation is the one who made these CPUs. And as you can see, the, the gold here is very, very thin. Look how thin this sheet of film is. This is a silicone sheet of film and this is what is called a tape automatic bonding process and the tape automatic bonding process utilizes a technology that is known as IC integrated circuit and we know the in integrated circuit or ICs do not use pins. There are no pins in IC circuitry. So um, I just had to make this video to let uh, fellow e-bears know um, if you decide to purchase these you see what you're getting. And there's very little gold on there. Look how thin that is. Now you tell me can you get any gold off of that? I got 250 of these and I put them on the scale, the poster scale, and came around a little over 6 ounces. And you know that the majority of the weight is going to be in the film and that silver shiny thing in the middle with the little uh, uh, wires onto it, the solder mass, just around the edges up there. There are no pins. His ad says that there are pins. And there are no pins. That's all. Whatsoever. Are there any pins on this um, CPU? He said these CPUs came from the supercomputer that Kendall Square Research was using to build their supercomputers back in the 19, 1994 or so era. So I'm just proving you know, that these do not have pins on them as he claims. And of course, those of us that know that micro uh, chips do not use pins. The very purpose of IC was to eliminate the use of pins. So no matter what he's claiming, there are no pins at all on those CPUs. These are pins. Gold-plated pins.